Howdy guys, in today's video of Flexi Starter, we're going to be looking at the job area under the production manager. But before that, let's have a quick intro first. So today's video can be found on softwaretraining.co.za. We make short and easy to watch problem solving videos and we also have daily updates. Otherwise, back in the program, just a quick reminder. This is a mini series on working with a project manager and I will also leave relevant links in the description so you guys can actually follow along. Now, um, in order to look at the job area, we obviously first need to open the pro uh, production manager. So um, you guys should know by now how to do it, I hope. <laughs> Otherwise, under your standard toolbar, there's a little um, cut and plot feature. It's probably the quickest way to go there. Then uh, my production manager is already open, but I wanted this uh, cut and plot open as well. So I can just show you guys a few things. So now, first of all, obviously you need a job so we can see what it does. So what you can do is we go here to our cut and plot feature. Then um, you just simply click send at the bottom and then it will send the job. Now, if for some reason you do not have the job after you click send, chances are you've got more than one cutter enabled and then um, or active. So then what you want to do is make sure under your job area, you select here under the top. I mean, sorry, under your current plot area, you want to set by the setup list, the right printer. And then you can click send again, go to your job area. And then you will see now under the test one, now we have that job. So um, that is just something to keep in mind because uh, it can happen where you send it to the wrong device and then you don't see it for some reason but it's actually under another device so now under the actual job area we've got a few different settings here as you can see so i'm just going to hide this for now cloud base so we can see all of it so first of all we've got setup so this will be the um, name of the design uh, of the device which um, the file will output which as you can see is this one then we've got the job name here so this will be um whatever you've saved the the file as and then it says dot job as you can see at the end and we've got the status which is currently it's um hold in holding we've got the sender which is me and then we've got the dimensions this is the physical dimensions of the job we've got the amount of copies so this is the amount of copies is going to output and then um we've got the um what is it? Uh, file, oh, sorry, the ICC. Well, we don't actually have it yet. And my apologies. So we've got the cut, um, the, the file type, which is going to be a cut job. So it's not a plot. We've got the file size, color. So it's multiple colors. And then um, after output, delete. And then we've also got the date. So this is a nice place where you can just confirm things before you send it. So like mine is on holding or if you have it paused, then you can first go here, make sure everything is right. Maybe you know, it's, oh, I actually need multiple copies. Then you can do this before outputting. And then, um, yeah, then when you're finally ready, you just hit the send button on the top here on the toolbar. But otherwise, yeah, that is it on the job area. If we had to head here to softwaretraining.co.za, you guys will notice we've got a variety of different softwares we do cover. And also you can isolate your um, searches here on the top right. If you do not, however, find the videos you're looking for, just go here, request a training video, then we will make that video for you. But otherwise, thanks guys for watching and cheers.